Hi guys, Deadly World here with another game video. We're today, welcome back to The Escapist, The Walking Dead, where yes, I know, it's been forever since we played this game, but we're back, finally, I know, forever, but hey, today we're going to be continuing where we left off, I did a bit of practice, and the reason I stopped this series is because I screwed up last time I played. So, you may have noticed last time that we finished off the good old green family farm. Which was fine. Except, I lost the footage for the Merryweather Correctional Facility. So the entire first episode was just gone. So, I'm going to start a new game. And we're just going to go from there. And hope I'm not too rusty. I did a bit of practice. I completed the Green Family Farm again. Just to... Well, started it really. And yeah, we're just gonna go here, hit new game, and go from there. Rick and the group situation goes from bad to worse when their RV runs out of gas and they take to walking. Until... Up the hill, da da da. I don't know. I have no commentary. Oh man, it's full of them. We can't go in there. No, we can. We can make this work. So fast. With Rick establishing that the newly discovered prison may not be safe for the moment, he sees potential in the probable supplies and offerings. Oh my goodness! I, why, why can it be quick to proceed? Why? Why? Okay, that's fine. Game started. I'll take it. I will take it. I will deal with what I must. But all right, here we go. Rick's journal. I don't know how long I keep my energy up, but I have to keep going. There's just... There has to be a generator in this place. There has to be! I must remain strong for my family and those who trust me with their lives. I must keep strong. I have to. Alright, this game is very much like The Escapist, but it, it has zombies instead of guards, and the zombies act much different than the guards. So, yeah, there's that to consider. I think I got this. I hopefully got this. Time to rob people. Now, I don't quite remember what to do at the start, but I think I remember roughly. And I happen to know a few things I didn't know last time. But at the moment I'm just grabbing some materials. We're gonna go from there. That's really the idea. Just gonna go. Face the undead. I guess. I don't know, man. Okay, we made it to breakfast. It's good, we got a weapon. That'll be our weapon for now. And yeah. Started as far as things go, first step, get rid of zombies. Solution to this? Attract them inside and have them get obliterated by our people. Come on. We're going to breakfast. It's not a very conventional way. We're just gonna get you obliterated zombies because that many people on you at once, they don't stand a chance. Alright. So we've made some progress toward the generator. But of course there's still zombies blocking the way. Hello, sir! One zombie, two to three people should be able to take that. Ah, oh, jeez. Rest up, please, so you don't die. That's the last thing we need people dying. It's just not ideal. Jeez, this place is a lot of zombies. Is this the last one? 
Alright, there's two, so hopefully we're gonna go on to another gathering of some sort soon. I don't know how to get rid of these guys. Oh, boy. Oh, no. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. They're really doing a number on me, which isn't helpful. I think we're good. It seems like we're good. I'm just putting everyone in danger for absolutely no reason. Because that is what a good leader does. Obviously. Alright, it's job period, so, yeah. I have to take the whole don't raise the zombies anger thing very seriously. Or, not so much anger as much as numbers? I don't know, really. To be honest, I'm just winging it. Are you gonna finish it off for me? Why are you following me? Wait, did I tell you to follow me somehow? I don't think I did. I don't know how I got him following me. That is, I didn't mean to. That was not on purpose. <laughs> I wasn't prepared to have someone following me around. But alright. You've made it. As far as the generator goes, I don't remember. Well, we made it over toward it. And... Okay, this room's related. But there's no way it isn't. If I had ladders, I could climb up to see what's above me. Alright, so we need a ladder. I think... I want to say that's with tins of paint. Where I fall. Yeah. Okay. My memory is not completely faulted. Okay. We need more tins of paint, which means we need more stuff, which means we should probably get access to in there. So I should probably get rid of another zombie. It's logical. So we got another walker on the way. Alright, so that's another one down. We're in afternoon. Let's get some more zombies down. Hello, friendo. Would you like to follow me? And get yourself destroyed. You know, this is a giant room of zombies. I might just cut to when I get rid of them. Herschel. I took down a zombie myself. Partially. I had help, but still. I was the one who did the dealing, the final blow. So yeah, there's this giant room full of zombies. I might just... How do I put it? Oh, uh, this is not my job right now. Kitchen position. Alright, now I need you... To help me fight a zombie. Alright, Glenn. Let's get to work. 
Yeah. All right. Oh, there's another desk in here. These are usually useful. I should put some stuff away. Okay, we're just on the afternoon now, so no risk to doing stuff. Those are all components. Let's free my inventory up a bit. Grab this food can and put it in here because I can. <sighs> Things aren't going too bad and oh well I'm good. So yeah, I'm gonna clear out this room of zombies. A few zombies at a time hopefully. And not all at once. Alright, one to start off with. Fine then. Okay, here's the desk I can look in without triggering all the zombies, so... I know paint, so it's kind of just... Eh. Hi. Oh. It's a three. It's, uh... Risky. You know what, let's just save. There's still gonna be zombies in the base, but I think everyone should be able to take them. Like, everyone versus all the zombies I brought in should be good. Okay, we all good? We're all good. Phew! Okay, we're gonna stick around and give motivation. Welcome to the buffet. Murder. Alright, so, we have a new area to look at. So that's good. Overall, they're doing too badly. So we have a desk and a bag we can work in. Which is nice. Bunch of stuff we can't really use. This could be useful. Oh wait, no, we didn't even look in the hold all. We looked at the same thing twice. Crowbar, a can paint, crafting notes, pickaxe, pretty self explanatory. Although, now we have all the tins of paint we need for the freaking ladder. So we might be able to go into that one area before the end of this episode. That'd be great. I just put some of this stuff away. We can go. Okay, so now we just need more stuff to get into the vents. Because that's what this ladder is going to reveal. And usually vents mean vent covers, and vent covers are never good. So, I guess the screwdriver might confess one, the chances are there's two. And just the more cutting materials we have, the better, I would think. So it's just generally a matter of that, and I think this is enough, really. Oh. Well, okay, fine. We can quickly do this. So with our newly found makeshift ladder, we're gonna head over here. And just here. Oh, you just put it on the ground. Okay. So probably wanna start off with the screwdriver because that'd probably be the best thing to start off with. And we'll see what we can get done. Hopefully we can get in there. That'd be nice. Okay, good. We can. Anything else up here? No, it's just the ladder. Okay. So this side's the actual generator, it seems like. So we're probably going to want to go this way first. And there's desks down there, so we don't need more ladders to get back out. Which makes sense. They don't want to trap us. Okay, we 
we're good. We shook the rucksack. Crafting note, fuel siphoning kit. We need tubing and a jerry can. Damn, we need some fuel for this thing. Oh, come on. Okay, find items for a siphoning kit and get some riot gear. Oh, that's not ideal. Let's check this other area quickly. Cause we still have stuff to cut open vents, so I mean, we may as well. Oh really? Oh well, that was a waste then. We need one more cutting object. But okay, our next task is to get into another building. Seems. I'm gonna make a siphoning kit. Oh, there's, a, there's zombies right by the entrance. Alright, let's quickly deal with you. Since I have to get to dinner anyway. Alright, come on. We're going out. Got someone dead to fight. Three people versus two zombies? I think that'll work. got rid of them, which is good. But we had to do our job, sadly. Okay, water, and a lot of food cans. Man, still more? Okay, it's fine. I have one more thing. Of course there's a food kit. Oh, and now it's done. Fine. This is where we can lead people back still. Oh, really? Oh, it's in there. And from all sides, that looks like it's surrounded by the cyan key. Oh, really? Please tell me that's in here. Electric screwdriver, hatchet, bunch of stuff, and nothing. Let's check walls. No, it's for cutting. A locked door. Where did we get the key? In there, maybe? Oh, I don't... Okay, it's evening headcount. We'll do with that in the next day. That'll be good. Hello, I'm here to give you all motivation. I think one of our people went to sleep already, because they died. Not so much as died as much as just needed that. So yeah. We're approaching the half hour mark. I want to get these last two riot gears and the siphoning kit, maybe. Whether or not we'll get it is another story. It's just, it'd be nice. Files. We need tubing at the moment. Or a jerry can. Either way. Uh, okay, so I don't have time to make it over there. Really? Not one tubing? Okay, let's head over to Hickcamp soon. We're gonna make all the zombies angry. Nothing. Darn. Might be stuff we have to find out there, but I could have sworn I saw tubing earlier. There you go. Attended. There's also this closet, but it's just the janitorial supplies, evidently. 
it's time for meal. And I don't think we can bring back any zombies yet. Or at least not in time. And really, I just want to search for items at the moment. No baseball bat. Ooh. I mean, it's a good item in retrospect, but... Eh. Okay, you know what? There's two highly annoying zombies. You're both on me, friends. So we can go get you destroyed. Oh no. I like that they don't respawn, it's quite helpful. Oh, there's another! I just want to get in the room, man! Alright, people. We're on a mission. Let's do this! Alright, we gotta go this way. All right, people, two walkers. Are you ready? Let's do this. All right, please be the key, please be the key, please be the key. That doesn't look like the key. Darn it, where could this key be? I have a team of three, and you'd think we'd be able to manage it. <laughs> oh, we might have to get in there, because look, this wall is normal. So the wall's probably in there! Ah. So I have my team. I know. I know, friends. I know. It's scary out here. We got this. I, exactly my question, Rick. What are we going to do? There's one more desk we can check here. Nothing. No, yeah, you have to break down the wall to get in there. Um, we can try and clear out this area. as far as right now goes. Unless I can get my wall chipping. Actually, do I have wall chipping supplies? I might, actually. Okay, people, we might not be done. I might be able to get in that room, clear the room with zombies, go from there. Okay, I have two chisels. That might be enough. I don't know if you necessarily need three, which you might, there's no doubt there, but this is the best I got at the moment. So 
let's go. Alright, people. Let's do this. No, you need three. You, you definitely need three. Oh, no, you... No, two. Two, two, two. Two, two is fine. Okay, good. Nice. Okay, here we go. Alright, people. Oh, yeah, just really go through the door. <laughs> you know, just ignore the fact that we don't have the key. Really? Not in here either. Where do we go then? This is tricky. It's like... No way seems right. Unless... Okay people. Oh wait, no, we go with the ladder. Right, that's big in the vent. This is a risky move. We might die. People, gosh darn it, we got this. You can't go bladders. Crap. Uh, there's a doorway. Maybe we'll go around to the doorway. I shouldn't go in here for if I take dinner though. Fine. Uh, go back. In fact, I might just end off the episode here. Save all that for next time, because I tried. I I think I failed. Progress. Progress. And one percent shivel. You know... Oh, you can't even do that. It might be better to just chip into that area. Because at this point, all we can really do is just break walls and hope it works. Why are there zombies? What period did I miss? Oh, we need people to follow me. Carl. I want you to follow me. Carl. Darn it. I don't think it's possible to get in here and through here. Really? Some more desks here. One of them has one of the quests. Zombie got me down before I got it down. Great. That's gonna raise the percentage a lot. 
You know, we need to just get rid of that down. Get that way down. Okay. So I think I'm just gonna leave the episode here, because at this point I don't think we're gonna make any more progress, unfortunately, which sucks. I'm gonna try and figure out where this key is for next episode. I'll look it up, because I don't want to search every single building to like, find it. But, for now I'm gonna leave it there, guys. So thank you guys for watching the Deadly Emerald. If you enjoyed this episode of The Escapist of the Walking Dead, don't forget to like, subscribe, and well, all good stuff. I'll see you guys in the next one. Hope you enjoyed. Have a grand day.